Welcome to the project demonstration of electric drive technology and opportunities for future electric vehicles. So in this version we are demonstrating a project to drive the BLDC motor. So here we are using the BLDC motor of 12 volts DC motor and uh, which is of 1.5 amps ratings and the same will be driven by the voltage source inverter and here we are going to provide the PWM signals for the voltage source inverter by using PIC 16 f 72 microcontroller. So this is a normal electrical vehicle. The future electrical vehicles in order to uh, provide the maximum currents we are making use of this circuit. So this is the circuit we are providing for that uh, without uh, getting any harmonics and this is a common mode filter we are using. So this common mode filter consists of three capacitors and one High, uh, high voltage with high capacitance capacitor and the two inductors. So the main voltage for this motor is getting from this battery pack so which is 12 volt 2 amp battery pack and in that uh, we are using 3 4 volt 1 amp batteries these three are in connected in series so we will get a 12 volt 1 amp DC output which is a rechargeable battery. So let us see the recharge process for this battery just on the power supply of 230 volts to this transformer so the transfer rating say 230 volts AC to 12 volts AC 1 amp uh, transformer the output of this one is input to this regulated power supply board so it has uh, two stages one is uh, rectification to convert the AC to DC that to pulsating DC and with the help of this capacitor we are converting that pulsating DC to pure DC voltage and through this unidirectional current flow diode we are providing that to the uh, our battery for charging purpose. So whenever the battery is fully charged automatically the current will be uh, stopped using this battery as it will become the high potential one so the diode will block the current flow from the battery to the charging circuit so we can protect the charging circuit from uh, reverse currents and once the battery is fully charged it will take around 6 to 8 hours to be fully charged so till the duration we should keep the battery under charging only and after that automatically uh, this uh, diodes will block the current flow once the battery is fully charged they can protect the battery from overcharging and the 12 volts 1 amp DC output is input to this or common mode filter so which will provide us the less harmonics with more current stability while we are running the BLDC motor so when our uh, microcontroller provide the signals for PWM signals for this uh, voltage source inverter to control this then there will be a chance for getting the reverse uh, feedback currents and due to that the current uh, the microcontroller may behave abnormal and it can't control the BLDC motor directly while uh, getting the harmonics reverse. So here the process also like when we on this so it will initially give the beeps like that and again it have, we need to get the double beeps otherwise we need to re reset till you get the double beeps as a microcontroller need to provide the PWM signal to the VSC. It may be like 2 to 3 times right like that okay and now it start rotating means when we on that it's not providing the signals directly as it need more current till the capacitors and inductors getting charged till that the controller can't provide the PWM signals to this one so that's why we need to reset the microcontroller then only it will provide the signals to that like that now you can just restart it it can control directly as we are getting the sufficient voltage and current from the from this common mode filter so now without any like uh, hurdles we can control the BLDC motor directly right yeah in this one I am coming to the ratings in common mode filter we are using two inductors of 100 micro henry 12 volts and the two capacitors of each capacitor is 1000 microfarad 25 volts and this one is 2200 microfarad 25 volts so these are the ratings in this one and the microcontroller is PIC 16F72 microcontroller on this motherboard we can see the components like this steel blade one is the crystal oscillator to provide the uh, 20 MHz oscillator frequency to the controller and this one is the reset switch to restart the microcontroller which will play the major role in our project So we need to get the second beeps. Starting music will be there and thereafter we need to get the beeps. Right. So then only it can initialize properly and it can control the robot or sorry uh, so called BLDC motor by using the microcontroller. Right. 